Well, this is a special time of year in the European footballing cycle. It's where it all begins again. The lifting of the trophy, the winner's medals. That was all back in May. A mere reminder, a relic of the glory that was and what may be to come, perhaps, for one of these. It is a venue, this, which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. So it's back, bigger and better than ever before. I do hope everybody is ready for another ride on the emotional roller coaster. Bring it on, Peter. I'm looking forward to a competition that always delivers entertainment, whether through its football or indeed its supporting cast of, of emotions. Neither of these teams will want a, a trip back to the drawing board after this, so I think we can expect something quite lively. There's the whistle, and here we go. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Of course, Manuel Neuer. He doesn't just dominate his area, Peter. He seems to control the whole of the defensive third. He's excellent at mopping up any balls that make it through that defensive line. And what's more, he can often turn those interceptions into lethal counter-attacks too. It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Chilwell. And it's Sterling. Foot in. It's a throw in. And here's Muller. He's put away. Muller has been caught there. It's a foul. Sterling can hoist it clear. Mane. Aubameyang. Bayern Munich are very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. Chilwell, and it's played forward. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Sané. And it's Cancelo. And here's Sané. Whipped in. He's had a go!
Bayern Munich scored early, of course, and it's 1 0. That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Challenge, but fair enough. Muller, Sané, crunching tackle. Nothing wrong with that tackle. Ball won cleanly. Chilwell. Now it's Sterling, and here's Aubameyang. He's away. And Aubameyang! Aubameyang weighed up the options and picked the wrong one. And it's Mane. Oh, good interception. Gets it upfield. He's managed to get that all wrong. Muller. Kante gets it back. Finds himself eased off the ball. Goretzka, he's gone for it! Oh, that was nice, but not quite the end product required. Well, there are a few pockets of space that are being exploited, and they need filling, and fast. This possibly the last play of the half. Up he gets! Bayern Munich with another corner. Up to meet it! Well, that wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. This is proving to be a very... And the first 45 minutes are up. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, I think the scoreline offers a fair reflection of the level of endeavour from both teams. I think... They lead because they did most of the probing. A little more penetration, I think, should help them get the job done. Bayern Munich leading 1-0 at the break. Already up and running for the second half. Bayern Munich carrying a one-goal lead. Koulibaly gets it away. It's on a plate! Mane gets it back, he's tried one, and for a moment time stood still. That's just front foot enforcement, pressure leads to mistake, leads to chance. Brought forward, what does he try from here? And here's Muller, quick chance, has a pop! Well he should have done better and he knows it. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Final checks on the touchline, a change about to occur.
And here's Mane. That's great defensive work. It doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. Oh, look, his determination needed to be greater than the obstacle he was faced with, and it wasn't. Koeman, he's got through. Tries a shot! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. of headers all he'd be thinking is please ground swallow me up played out to the right Bayern Munich have it back and they can go again Conte. Well, it did look promising to start with, but in the end they were thwarted before they could even make it into the final third. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And it's Sterling. Just brushed off the ball there. Well, that's clear cut, it's a free kick. Good idea, just poorly executed. Koman, Gnabry, Muller. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Over to the left. And they're not going to make any further progress now. There's going to be another change here. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but couldn't help notice that he was starting to to labor a bit so it's no surprise and it's Mane there's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed but will they Good challenge, he just stood firm. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. Ford the shows there will be three extra minutes. Bayern Munich need to hold on for a few more moments. Uh, it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. And that's that, Bayern Munich have got off to an ideal start. Three points on day one, and it goes well for the campaign ahead. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Listen, ideally, any new campaign needs a start that puts three points on the board, and it's mission accomplished. Nothing too fancy was required, just a, a good solid team display for me.